Hi, and welcome to the second tutorial, uh, which is going to talk a little bit about how to create section views of your model. And again, this is going to carry over into the third tutorial where we actually learn how to create animations uh, by making scenes and linking them together into uh, an animation which can be used as a flyover or a uh, walkthrough to give an overall view of your model. So again, we're going to go ahead and start by opening the gazebo model. And again, if you're using the example uh, that I have provided, it should look like uh, this, what you see on the screen now. And what we're going to work with here is the section tool. And if you don't already have this toolbar open in SketchUp, you can get to it by going to the View tab, Toolbars, and opening the large tool set uh, that will give you this toolbar over here and you will notice that there is a section plane tool down in the bottom right hand corner If you click on that you'll notice the cursor changes to um, a section plane and depending on where you move it uh, it's going to change the surface we want it to point down in this direction here so we have a horizontal section and it doesn't matter where you click if you're over the model or over here in space just make sure the section arrows are facing the correct direction and just go ahead and click and you'll notice that that cuts a horizontal section plane um, and it starts down at the bottom of the model now by moving that using the move tool you'll notice the higher you go up the higher that section is going to go now the reason we're using this is not just necessarily to create a section but use the section tool in our animations which we're going to use a little bit later and actually show this movement here um, in the animation okay so the way we're going to do that is we're going to start with the section plane line section plane down at the bottom and we are going to go up to the view tab down to animation and we are going to add a scene okay we're going to cover a lot more about uh, creating scenes and, and editing them and, and things like that in the next tutorial when we actually learn how to create an animation uh, but to see how we're going to use the section view we're going to start here with a scene uh, so we're creating a scene with a section plane down at the bottom so that we do not see any of the gazebo uh, and what we want to do next is not move this section plane but we're actually going to add a second section plane and same thing in the same direction Sorry, I didn't want to do that. We still want to keep this in a horizontal section plane, and we're going to move that one up, all the way up to the top. And when we have that completed, we're going to go back up to view, and we are going to add another scene. Now by doing that, you'll notice the scene tabs that pop up at the top. We have scene one, and we have scene two. Uh, later on in the next tutorial, we're going to have uh, more of these and be able to link them together into a uh, sort of video. Um, but for this, you'll see the purpose. If we, if we flip back to scene one, we start with our original section, uh, and there's no gazebo shown because we cut the section down to the bottom. As you flip to the tab, you'll actually see uh, the beginning of an animation that will take us from the first section plane up to the second section plane, and what it does is create an effect of the gazebo basically being built from the ground up uh, when we use this in an animation form. All right, so again, we're on scene one. If I click the scene two, you'll actually see those planes uh, being moved. Uh, if you don't like the section planes being shown, you can go up to the view tab and turn the section planes off, and then they will not be visible and you'll still get the same effect. All right, so we would start with scene one, scene two, and there we go, the gazebo has been built. So uh, this is just another sorry. So this is just another effect that we can use to basically change our model or represent our model uh, when we do our animation to basically give um, a view or a representation of, of how we want to present the model. Um, 
So it's just kind of a neat effect that shows the gazebo being built from the ground up. And um, we'll get more into it in the next tutorial. But it's another tool you can use along with the styles which we covered in the first tutorial. Um, so if you're comfortable with the styles and now you're comfortable with using the section tool uh, and, and starting to create those scenes that can transition, you want to move on to the third tutorial where we really get into the meat and bones of creating animations and being able to export them into a movie format. So go ahead and play with your uh, section tool and make sure you're comfortable using that and go ahead and move on to the next tutorial.